Hey there, Foundation Sir. Jones, how's Galaxia doing? She's doing well, so far. She's recovering at a faster rate due to her celestial powers. You'd be happy to hear she's okay. That's right. The scientist is still treating her right now, to ensure she recovers the best she can. Okay, that's good to know. Is Guy doing alright too? After the whole event? Hey. No need to panic. She's present with Galaxia, comforting her at the moment until she's back to full health. Oh, okay. May I see both of them, please? Of course. Just be sure to go easy in there. She's probably quite tired. Understood. Be sure to check your results again in a little bit, your highness. If you need anything, don't be afraid to ask. <sighs> okay, thank you so much, sir. And thank you for... Well, not telling my mother about this whole problem. I think she's likely to shout first, then ask questions later. You're very welcome. I'm always happy to help. I feel the same way. My mother would always embarrass me, holding like a guilt trip on me when I did something wrong. Well, anyways, I'll be back. Have a nice rest and see you shortly. Goodbye, Mr. Scientist! Oh, hey, Wingman. How are you? That battle to Beagle sounded super intense. I'm good, thanks. We defeated. Woo! We defeated the villains <laughs> and sent them back to the universe they came from. Same with Spider-Man. I'm gonna miss him. Anywho, Galaxia, how is she feel? How is she healing? Eh, pretty good. She still needs a few more hours of rest. But that aside, she'll be back to full health soon. I'll be back to talk on her later. See ya, buddy. Yep. See ya. Hey Sky, Galaxia, how are you two holding up? You're back! Question is, how are you doing? <gasps> Did you and the three Spider-Man defeat the Goblin guy? Yep, indeed. We combined our strength, wits, and abilities to beat him. There was another guy, Carnage, like a red symbiote monster. He escaped. Hopefully we never to be seen again. Oh, awesome! I bet you use the sword of magic and everything. So cool. Okie dokie. Well, I'm gonna find Jones. You two can sweet talk each other now. Go kiss or something. <laughs> what? Excuse you, lady. What was that last part? Hey there, Princess, how's your leg? Do you feel okay now? Oh, um, it's, it's good. I must say, congrats on defeating that evil goblin guy. And the way it sounded, like some extreme fight. Eh, it was very much. Thank, and thanks, how was everyone else? Did you all get back okay? Where's Smoke and Fade? I figured they'd be been here. Yeah, they're fine. God, you're, you talk so quickly. Too many questions. It's giving me a headache. You were here, but went to do some island surveillance. Orders from the Foundation to ensure nothing's out of the ordinary. Oh, sorry, I didn't understand. I, I talked to them when they- I'll talk to them when they return. Oh, hey, wanna hear some cool superhero names I've been working on myself? In case I get, like, a... Uh, a war that has my hero name on it. <laughs> uh, but some sounds stupid.
<laughs> oh, um, sure thing. What's wrong, man? Eh, it's just some basic. How about the Red Fury? Or how about the Red Mist? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got one. How about the Red Justice? Stupid. What? Why? Look, pretty sure that's Batman's trademark. Anyway, so. You can't be serious. You know Batman. But you know Batman, but not Spider-Man before you met him. Oh my lord! I don't care. Maybe once the scientist comes back, he's gonna appreciate it very well. Whatever. He's gonna completely agree with me. Why, Major Princess? I beg your pardon? Nothing, nothing. <whistles> Even if the Red Justice is trademarked, I can ask Batman. I'm positive he'll let me use it. We defeat a giant Storm King, Demi King, and save the whole island together. Pretty sure we're best friends. Okay, lovebirds. I'm back with Results. Scientists! It, it's, it's not like that! You're the man I want to see. I have a good question for you. Sure. Anyway, what's your question? Okay, so I made some cool hero names in case I get an award to, to be on a newspaper or something like that. Which name should I use? The Red Fury, the Red Mist, or maybe the Red Justice? Gonna be honest with you, it was a crap names first. The red mist means anger, and you're not always angry, unlike somebody I know. Secondly, I wouldn't describe you with the word fury, at least not yet. Ha! <laughs> Loser! Into your face! Zip it! Okay, what about the red justice? <sighs> Wingman, listen. Having a co-name or alias or hero name in this case, it doesn't make you look cool or a better hero than you already are. A okay, co-name for a hero such as yourself is great. Go for it. When you're being a hero, you want people to see a beacon of hope. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, yes I do. Okay, good. Now if you excuse me for one second. Your Highness, I got your chest results. Your leg is perfectly healed. You'll be fine in a couple of days. Rest up. Oh, and by the by, three of the members of our team are coming to help us playing an attack. In the future, they'll be at war against the IO. They're back. Wait, the IO? The Imagine Order? I remember that name. A lady, Dr. Sloan, she was one of the people I teamed up to defeat the, the, the Dark Lord. Yeah, the IO. You've heard of that? Wait, you worked with her? worked with them. But I know who and what they are, yes. I don't understand the problem. We defeated a giant agent overlord together. Oh boy, kid. Look, you've had history with them like me and the rest of the seven, which isn't good. They are the single most largest threat to the zero point, and they're the ones that brought these loopers, well, more like innocent people, here to this island. They're the most significant threat to the zero point and the omniverse as a whole. Deep breaths. I need you not to mention this just yet. We're meeting some people soon. Very well. I promise not to say a word. This doesn't sound good at all. It's not, but I'm glad you understand. Now then, let's get back to the Foundation's warm room. He wants us. So, I'll see you later, huh? Yep. I told you that he'll think it's dumb. And whatever, Princess, I'm gonna keep the name Red Justice. <laughs> <sighs> I'm too tired to argue with you any longer. See you later, loser. <laughs> Very funny. Well, see ya.
So, Gunner, my beloved and most feared enforcer of I.O., anything else we should know about the Seven? How about the Foundation? Did you pick up on anything? Negative. Not yet, ma'am. But we shall be gaining new intel soon enough. Don't you worry. <laughs> oh, please. In the time frame we're scrambling for fractions of intel, I know for a fact they'll plan something fast. Especially now that Jones is working with them now. After he betrayed us. Any tactical advantage? I want to be the first told. Understand? Roger that, ma'am. Very well. I'll get right on it. Our field team members are already scouting areas to claim as our territory. The more land we take, the easier it is to push these little mice into a corner before we wipe them out. Dr. Sloan, he's here. Very good. Send them in here, please. You may enter. Dr. Sloan will see you now. Well, hello there. It isn't a good old chaos agent. It's nice to be acquainted with you here. <laughs> I also like the new look on you. If it's the whole chaotic vibe to it, you know? <laughs> oh, da. Yes, it's nice to speak with you again, Miss Shlo. I'm assuming you're planning to find a way to destroy the Seven and those pesky little heroes. Squash them like the bugs they are, huh? This is their island after all. Indeed I am. It won't be their island for long, my goopy friend. We're claim was once ours, and as for Agent Jones, he'll pay the price he owes. But yes, I already sent our top enforcer, Gunner, out to look for new members. Our forces shall outnumber those of the Seven. Anyone who opposes I.O. shall have a bad end to their day. Oh, okay. Very nice, Doctor. You sound very ambitious. Yet, but I have something else to show you I brought with me here today. You should definitely have this be a part of your little team. Oh, really? You just have some assets in your back pocket? Hurry up and show me. Very well, Doctor. I present to you Metal Mouth and Suki 
Now to defeat that ancient evil overlord, his powers must be growing. I want him gone as well. You hear me, Chaos? Yes, ma. Oh, before you leave, Chaos, tell that professor friend of yours I said thank you for bringing these beautiful robots. They'll be useful in wiping out the Seven whilst their, this island is in pure disarray. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Very well, Doctor. Okay, then, little robots. Let's go! Yes, be seeing you, Doctor. <laughs> it's all according to plan. You can't hide for long. Seven. Hey there, what's happening? We're waiting for her to arrive. Sorry, her? I don't follow. Correct. Wingman, I want you and Sky to act nicely and be polite to them, okay? It's been quite a while since they were on the island. Even since the Foundation has seen them himself. And I'm sure any of us would like a warm welcome if we were them. They are here to aid us in this fight. You're not wrong there, Jones. These members are very important for our cause. And please greet them nicely. Yes, you sir. can definitely I hear you. count on us, Mr. Foundation, sir. Alrighty then. I'm glad. Wingman and Sky, I want you both to please meet the Imagine One of the Seven. Glad to have you back. Ah, good to see you again, Imagined. Welcome back to Reality Zero. We're glad you've joined us for this fight, Imagined. Hello there, my name is Wingman. Oh, hey Foundation, who is who is your other arrival? 